Jesus Christ movement, which, you know, we always got to put God first, but you was into a little bit of everything, and I like you like that, bro. I appreciate but it. I don't know what you're doing now, but what you were doing now was, was solid. I appreciate it, man. Look, we just going to keep it moving. I'm going to come through. We're going to talk about, you know, shooting some stuff with the shop. You know, I mean, what, you know, filming you, you know, do your customer service thing. You know, anything you want to put together, we put together like a minute piece on the shop. And and just keep it moving, man. We, I mean, I, I want to do it. And it's something that ain't going to cost you nothing. Something that you can use as a tool to draw in your business. You know, and we can just keep it moving from there, fam. I got you. Yeah, my dude. A lot of people don't like to embrace whatever you're doing, but you don't let that hold you down. You keep it moving. But I was just checking you out. I like my man that's doing production. He's doing news. He got a lot of things going on. He's doing big things. So, I, you know, I respect that. Big ups to what you're doing, my brother. I appreciate and it. That's, and that's dope. I mean, so again, yeah, whenever you back in town or whatever you're doing, my dude, you know, I'm at the spot. You know where I'm at. What time are you in the shop tomorrow, man? Man, son, I'm there every morning at 10.30, i I'm there every day. Only day I'm not there is Monday. But I go in there Monday and count inventory and just figure it out. But I'm there every day, Tuesday through Saturday. I'm there first thing, baby. I'm going to roll through yeah. for a few minutes, man, so we can wrap and, and start setting up your shoot. All right, yeah, son. I see you was hitting with the entertainment. Yeah, hit me back. <laughs> go through. You got it. All right, my dude. One. One. That's uh, <laughs> the barbershop, and he just saw where, um, where like I, I thanked him, hit these businesses up, and you know just give them a thank you spot. Businesses that I work with, especially like the small businesses and stuff, and you know what it all boils down to is like you know more, more than anything with small businesses. They can't compete with big box stores, and that's what big box stores have done to our country. They've moved in and they took away the mom and pop stores, and you know the little man trying to you know feed his family, put food on his table, and you know the change of technology and cross marketing. Most people have it in their minds that you know they have to have this you know all this money and this big budget to be able to market themselves. I mean, social media, especially in this area, you know, a lot of a lot of areas man it's like social media is where where it's at that's how people you know communicate more than pretty much tv these days i mean i believe and you know when you got word of mouth and you got social media man that's the that's a that's a great way to, to market yourself and you know so you know i go i go and that's that that's my man that's what you know he does he cuts my hair you know good customer service and i believe in you know what he's doing as far as the community you know giving some of these kids you know opportunities to come in and sweep and and work around the shop and you know he'll you know cut them a deal or you know give them haircuts and stuff you know just to keep them clean and keep them productive and that's that's the community that i live in that's the community that that i that i still live in yeah i live in tennessee now but you know, every community of where I live, I, I, I actually look for that subculture, that hub that still contributes to the community. Something that is rare these days. These kids are like losing, you know, families are losing their babies to like the street and and drugs and all of this stuff. And our, our young ladies are getting pregnant at a young age. Well, you know, there's, there's, there's an outreach that's going on and it's always been like that, believe it or not, with hip hop music. I mean, hip hop music was created to keep these kids from, you know, gang banging in the street. You know, if, if it ain't, you know, it, that's hip hop culture. Not to be confused with, you know, some of the stuff that we see now. I come from the old school, you know, that's what we did. We created, you know, more productive things to keep the kids off the street and to be off the street and to be able to have a voice still in society, something that's rare these days. You know, oh, there, there aren't many people doing that sort of thing. So I picked up on what Trill was doing, you know, every time, you know, I go through, we talk about stuff and everything and he's real, he's, he, he takes a lot of pride in, in, in what he's doing with these kids. So I. I wanted to, to, to help him. You know, he's helping these kids. I want to help him. So, I, you know, I, I gave him a thank you because he did my hair. You know, I'm in front of the camera, and you know, for what I do. 
And he just called me, and he—I mean—he really appreciated what I did. So now it's like I'm like one step further. And let's let's help your company grow. You know what I mean? And it's like you know, from where I am, True Sam Entertainment. You know, I've been doing this for years. You know, I, I've just upgraded my technology, and if I can share it to help the small man build, and especially the small business owner that's contributing to the com community in a positive way, especially to our babies, then that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm about. That's the truth. You know? So, I mean, that's that's what it is. And um, so tomorrow I'm going to see him, and we're going to start storyboarding the commercial for his business, and, you know, we're just going to keep it moving from that. You know, you see, you hear how excited he was? You know, I mean, we're doing this. It's like it's it's bad enough. You know, it's 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 it, this is the outreach that I do outside of the church. You know what I mean? And you know, we need more of it. We need more of it. 